Hello and welcome. In this tutorial, we're going to learn about while loop. With the while loop, we can execute a set of statements as long as the condition is true. Let me show you an example of how to use a while loop. Here we have declared a variable and assigned a value of one to the variable. And we're using the keyword while to create a while loop. And the while loop is evaluating while the variable with the value of one at the beginning is less than 10, print out the value of the variable and increment the the variable by one at each iteration of the loop the variable will be incremented by one when the value of the variable is equal to 10 the while loop will stop because of this line saying while this variable is less than 10 so 10 will not be printed and if we print out this now you can see that the printout is from 1 till 9 and 10 is not included because we are looping through the variable and incrementing it while it's less than 10 and that is how to use a while loop with the break statement, you can stop the loop even if the while condition is true. Here we have a variable and assign the value of 1 to the variable. And we're using the keyword while the variable is less than 7. Print the value of the variable at each iteration. Underneath the print function, I have an if statement that is evaluating the value of the variable when the variable is equal to 3. And I'm stopping the while loop with the break keyword. So at the third iteration, when the variable is equal to 3 the while loop should stop and I'm using this line here to increment the value of the variable at each iteration so when we run this code now as you can see the printout of the value of the variable stopped at 3 because of this if statement and the break keyword and that is how to use the break statements in while loop with the continue statement we can stop the current iteration and continue with the next iteration let me show you an example of how to use the continuous statement. Here I've defined a variable and assign a value of 1 to it. Using the keyword while, I'm evaluating while the variable is less than 7, increment the variable and if the variable is equal to 3, continue, meaning skip the loop when it's equal to 3 and move on to the next iteration. And using this print function to print out the value of the variable at each iteration. So you will notice that the variable is incremented before it's printed out. So the first printout will be 2 because we're incrementing the value of the variable using this line. So if we print out this while loop now, as you can see, the first value of the variable is 2. So when the value was 3, the loop stopped the current iteration and moved on to the next iteration, which is 4. And that is how to use the continuous statement in a while loop. With the else statement, we can run a block of code once when the condition no longer is true. Here we have a variable num and we've assigned a value of 1 to it. And we're using the keyword while the variable is less than 7. Print the value of the variable and we're using this line to increment the value of the variable at each iteration. And the else keyword is used here when this section of the code is no longer true. So this part of the code will run when the evaluation of the variable is less than 7 is true so when the when the value of the variable is no longer less than 7 this part of the code will be printed once so if we run this code now as you can see at each iteration the value of the variable was increased from 1 to 6 and that is because of this while loop here so while the value of the variable is less than 7 so 1 to 6 is less than 7 those integers were printed out so once the variable was no longer less than 7 the else statement kicks in and this printout was then printed out because the value of the variable was no longer less than 7 so the while loop was no longer true so the loop stopped and this printout was then printed out and that is how to use the else statement within a while loop in python and that's it for this video please remember to subscribe to my channel and press the notification icon so you can get notified each time i publish a new video thanks for watching and i will see you on the next one